morning. An early morning, but I know you guys are used to early mornings because you're surfers yourself and you follow the tour. So how exciting is it to have your music set over the broadcast? Great taste. It's awesome. Great taste of music. <laughs> you guys have done well there. Very well. I think we've done well as well. It was cool. I didn't actually, I kind of forgot and I was watching the highlights yesterday so I could be up yeah. to speed when I came today. And I was like, oh, it was amazing. I love this song. <laughs> We love the song as well. And if you guys love it, you can actually get it on iTunes. That was Blondie. So you guys love to follow the tour. What brought you out to Hasagor? Was it the tour or are you guys performing out here? It was definitely the waves that brought me. Um, I ran away from, from the UK to, to live the life out here. Uh, and I met these boys. Yeah, and I was traveling because my cousin owns a bar up the road. And we all met there, basically. Yeah, we're all just kind of surfing and living in our hands and didn't want to get real jobs. So we just made it Didn't want to wash dishes, so we just started playing uh, guitar. I did for a bit, though. So. You wash dishes for a bit? Are you good at it? I am the, the best. best. <laughs> That's fantastic. I need a little help with that. So, <laughs> speaking of the t your guys' tour, you are getting ready to go on tour with Imagine Dragons. You yeah. leave, like, in an hour, in right? An hour. The in boys leave minutes. in an hour, yeah. Ten minutes? Twenty minutes? Ten minutes. Pretty soon. Yeah. And how did that all come about? Uh, they just they just liked us. They chose. Um, we and we liked them. And yeah, we got in a big list of bands, and that got down to a small list of bands, and... Yeah, we were the last band left. And then they just rang someone, <laughs> and, and that's the one said, do you want to go on tour for two months and play 30 arenas? And we went, yeah. We're going to play to 300,000 people. It's not bad. We're, we're, we're very excited. Okay, so very, I, very excited. I hope I know the answer to this question. Yeah. Well, I know you guys are going to be kind of busy on your own tour, but will you be following our tour while you're on tour? For sure. We, will. we were actually, to be honest, uh, we were in the, we, we were doing some recording, and we had the, uh, Laptop set up to watch the watch the tour. We watch it where we can. It's always on. It's always we, on in the studio. All we the always time. Yeah. we always try to put up an Instagram of us watching it on the mobile app on the piano, on the computer. Ah, see, I like the app. The app is really helpful. So, do you guys have a pick for the men or the women who you think is going to win a world title? Because we're fairly close on both sides of the tour. Uh, look, okay, I'm a, I'm a big Dane fan. I think this one. And I know I know he's I know he's not going to win it. <laughs> right, but I hope he wins this one. I did uh, play a wave yesterday. <laughs> Pete did actually. We got, we got a cheeky little surf with him, which was nice. Yeah. We, we hung around him. <laughs> uh, fanning. It's, it's I'm, I'm, all, I'm all about fanning, eh? Hey? After the year he's had, uh, with the uh, mishap of the, obviously, the shark. Yeah, that's going to be cool. I'm, 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 I'm a big fan. So we got to vote for Mick. And yep. You? I'm Mick, for sure. I'm going to have to go Mick as well. We're we all the same. All right, and we got a ladies' and tour. We got a ladies' tour, so who do you think is going to win it on the ladies? You got a choice Ooh, between uh, a couple of ladies. Courtney Conlog, Carissa. I mean, Corny's looking pretty good. Yeah, they're both looking really good, eh? I was watching the highlights yesterday while we were setting up. Um, yeah, you go. Carissa? A unanimous Carissa. Courtney, then. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love that, Rory. And also, they have a Twitter contest. If you guys want to spend more time with them, which I don't know why you wouldn't, you can follow them on Twitter, and they will fly you out to one of their tourist stops with Imagine Dragons, and it doesn't get better than that. It doesn't get better than that. Even if you just want to see Imagine Dragons. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's the same. This goes to, to all the Imagine Dragons fans. Yeah, just follow us on Twitter. It's okay. you know, I'll be following them. I'm leaving tomorrow. <laughs> all right, thank you guys so much. When we come back from the show, we will have a preview of round three. You're not going to want to miss it. Thanks so much for joining us. Thanks, guys.